Hey guys, so today we do have a new little cool thing here. Uh, it basically is a real physical mock-up of a 5.5 inch iPhone 6. And you can actually see this is pretty funny because they've basically stacked um, a, an iPhone 5S, the current generation iPhone, uh, on top here. So it looks pretty intense. It looks pretty much way bigger. Uh, and, and I mean, this is the thing, I mean, I have put my, uh, sometimes I do put my, my iPhone 5 or, or my 5S uh, on top of my, my Galaxy Note 2. And the cool thing with the Galaxy Note 2 is, I mean, the Galaxy Note 2 is 5.5, same as this one, and it kind of looks the same. Um, it is, uh, it, it looks super huge here, I mean, it looks like a joke. Uh, but that's just because the iPhone is a joke. I mean, the iPhone 5 and the 5S right now, they are a joke in size. I mean, they are too small. Uh, four inch is like, that's like two years or three years behind the curve of what people really, really do want. I mean, people want the good, the big stuff uh, because the big stuff sells and you see more stuff. The key thing why Apple hasn't changed is because it's just, they save more money. You don't have to change any major things like the screen size and everything. But in this mock-up, I mean, look at it. It looks super big. Uh, it looks intense, but um, it's not It's not that intense. Uh, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like an iPod touch design. Uh, and I mean, I'm gonna be honest here. If Apple pull this off, if Apple release a 5.5 inch iPhone 6, that's probably gonna be my main phone. That's probably will be my main phone. I mean, I've been a Samsung Galaxy Note user now for three years. I started to use the original Galaxy Note at the end of 2011. And then I used that one, I think, for a year or so. And then when the Galaxy Note 2 came out, I started to use that one. And then I used that one for a year or something. Maybe I think it was a little bit more. And then that one became super slow uh, because it was running on an old Android version, but now it seems like they've been upgraded to Android 4 KitKat and Android 4 3, uh, so they're in a way quicker. Uh, and right now I'm actually using my Galaxy Note 3, which is it's starting to get a little bit slow as well. Um, but that's, I mean, I have 3,700 pictures on my phone, and that's pretty intense. Uh, but uh, I've noticed that I used to take more and more pictures and I can't wait to see our next big major phone. Now the key thing here also is that it's going to be having have to be stacked up against like a Galaxy Note 4. And I mean that's going to be intense bro. A Galaxy Note 4. I'm not sure maybe I'll go with the Galaxy Note 4. We don't know what the Galaxy Note 4 will offer. We we'll probably will see a Galaxy Note 4 because some of Galaxy Note series is um, selling like hotcakes. Uh, but a Galaxy a, a, an iPhone 6 5.5 inch versus a Galaxy Note 4 5.7 or maybe in 5.8 or 5.9 inch that's gonna be intense that's gonna be epic so finally Apple is stepping up and I can't wait to see what's gonna happen peace out